Hey, what's going on guys? It's TrekYT here, or Nick, back at it again with another brand new video and new series. So, one thing that I've been doing a lot of recently, and I've really been doing a lot of thinking on new series ideas of things to help people build better, and I thought to myself, how did I become a better builder? And I realized it's really from just looking at other people's builds and just, I guess, taking the inspiration from what they have done and then using your own creativity and their creativity that you have monitored from and turning it into something amazing. So that's really how I started to build. I've always watched other people build. I've always thought that awesome, huge builds were just absolutely stunning and amazing like I just that's the way I learned how to build and that's what really inspired me to actually can like become a better builder so I decided that we're gonna start up a new series we're gonna also utilize that I now have a better PC so now I can run shaders mods to make these videos just this series I'm never gonna do shaders really in any other series I'm probably only gonna do it in this series but this is gonna be Minecraft inspiration basically we're just gonna find an amazing build one day we're gonna just bring it onto a single player world and I'm just gonna walk through it and talk about it really just I guess let you guys see this magnificent magnificent build and then we're just gonna like take our ideas from that and then you can use your creativity to build whatever you want so basically it's just me showcasing an awesome build that I think is really cool and then you can just take what you want out of it and then just go with it so let's go ahead and jump into this first ever episode of minecraft's inspiration so for every single episode i'm going to probably just go scour random creative servers so if you have like cool creative servers that you know about that you know that there's cool builds on I would love to know because basically I'm just going to go steal the build from that and then I'm going to leave the IGN of the person that actually made it or people that actually made the current build and I'm going to leave it down in the description because I have no part in making any of these builds. I just want you guys to see these magnificent builds so I'm just going to find the best ones that I can and then I'm going to give all credit to the builder down in the description. So check the description for the IGN of the person. I'll do my best if I can find social media links. I will try but for the most part, I'm only going to leave the Minecraft IGN. So let's start off this first ever episode, and we're looking at a boat. I found this boat. I'm not exactly where sure where I found this boat, but remember, just check down the description. So this is a awesome pirate-themed boat, or just awesome old-themed boat, wind-powered boat. It's just absolutely stunning. So when you're really looking at it, you can see that he's using a ton of layers to really sculpt the shell or the like the hull of the boat you can see how he's using stairs and slabs that are really creatively placed to curve all these arcs right here but then there's a million different arcs that work really well together to create this sort of like almost like oval type I guess 3d shape that is the hull of the boat and it's really really great how he used all these stairs and slabs periodically to create the right curve for this boat and you can just tell that he put so much time into this you can tell that it's very thought out and it's very creative like this is just so good it looks so realistic and that's why I really chose this for our first ever episode one thing that I'm really really liking that I may actually take inspiration from is these hanging lamps that he has every Everywhere. Now, I normally do hanging lamps in my builds, but I don't normally have them as big as this, but I think this design right here looks absolutely amazing. I think it looks really, really good. So this is one thing that I personally am probably going to take inspiration from if I ever want to do hanging lamps. Like he has another one over here. This one's sort of just jutting out from the side of the hull, but I really like that hanging lamp. That's one thing that I personally am going to take inspiration from when I want to incorporate hanging lamps. I'm going to try out something new, probably try it. Wow. Look at it from this side. Look at the way that the sun with the shaders mod just bounces off the side of the ship. It looks absolutely magnificent. Jumping onto the actual ship itself, one thing that I really like that people do is they use these heads and then they make them into objects of the game. So this is a chest and I really think it's really cool for them to have different sized shapes in of the heads that are different sized chests. So looks like we've got ourselves a little quarters down below, like the below deck. We've got a bunch of stuff on top of the ship. Looks like we got our ourselves a little anchor over here too. This looks pretty cool. This is actually a really good anchor. 
This is actually pretty cool looking. On the diagonal that he has it on is actually pretty cool as well. And it's got like a little storage or it goes down in here somewhere. Yeah, we're gonna head in there in a little bit. One thing that I thought would have been really cool is if somehow they had like a sculpture on the front, like like a mermaid or something like that. I don't know, I'm really getting to like Pirates of the Caribbean type stuff right now. So I think that's a pretty cool idea. I really like how he had buttons all over the side of the ship that really just, I guess, it's sort of like screws or nails. I mean, I'm just kind of trying to think of like realistic things that these blocks that these plays could be representing. I'm really just digging everything that he's doing on this bow. It's really, really, really good. And I just like looking at these base or these builds with the shaders mod because everything looks absolutely stunning. Now let's go ahead and head into apparently Captain Kirby's cabin. So haha <laughs> get it okay so this is pretty basic in here there's not too too much in here but it's just it's really also really nicely shaped you know it really uh, you can tell that this is meant to be on a boat so I think that's really cool he's got a ladder that goes all the way up to this little area so this is where I guess you would drive the ship from which you know in my opinion how are you supposed to know where it's gonna go if all this stuff is blocking your way that's that's just kind of funny to me I really like the use of the pistons up here, it's just another block that works really well for this build. I like the texture on top, he well, could have gone, I mean it could have been better if he did the um, six sided piston, that probably could have looked a lot better in my opinion, but I do like the use of the pistons, just adding in this texture, this part right here I think is a really nice texture, it's almost like a tile like texture. I think it would be actually pretty interesting to see this texture minus the white little blocks, just that could be a really cool like tiled floor. It's a very I guess stand outy tile floor if it didn't have those white parts on it. Now one thing that I also really like is the sails. He has all these random sails that are really really nice. One thing that I like that he's done about these sails is he's really texturized them. That's just such an amazing building technique is texturing things. And what texturing really is when I say that it's basically just mixing in different blocks that are really similar to each other but adds like a texture to it that makes it so it's not just that one bland block or one bland color but adding in just a little bit of texturing makes your eye look at it and just more pleased I guess in my opinion so he's textured it with it uh, looks like light gray and white wool which looks really really great together and then he has all of these um, fences that are I guess for the rigging so I guess these are simulating the ropes and stuff he's got these flags that are also going in almost like they're being hit by the wind which is also a very nice technique instead of just having a flat flag so this boat is absolutely amazing let's just zoom back and just look at this boat from a freaking glance oh my god it's so amazing it's so good now let's just take a little panorama around the outside of this boat now this I wish I could build this I really don't think honestly I do not think I could build this if I really tried I do not think I could do something as good as this this is absolutely amazing his sails are not flat they have shape to them they have movement to them they have an artistic movement literally artistic movement to them Wow, this is absolutely amazing, and this is what I'm really going to get at when I get to these inspiration series. These are more or less not only for you guys, this could even be for me because I can take inspiration from looking at all these amazing builds that are going to be showcased in all of these inspiration series. I'm probably going to do like once a week with these things depending on how it goes down with you guys, but I really like looking at amazing builds. I hope you guys looking like looking at amazing builds, and I think this is where we're going to bring this inspiration episode one to a wrap. Now, if you guys do like the addition, of this new series and if you think that this is going to be a successful series definitely show your support so I know that you guys will enjoy this series if you guys have any ideas of specific builds like places you guys want me to go check out to see some amazing builds I will definitely take that as an option so if you guys would like to see or like to show me something drop it down in the comments below say like exactly where the creative server is exact chords of the specific plot that you guys want me to check out just drop it in the comments i'll check it out maybe even go on twitter tweet me pictures of it so it's easier so i don't even have to go on there before so i can just make a quick decision like yeah i want to check that one out so if you guys want to uh, i guess submit not even have to be your build just a build you have seen that you think is amazing i probably already have a build lined up for next episode but i just wanted to give you guys that option to i guess get involved in showing me builds maybe even you have your own build that's absolutely amazing sort of like walrus did for the base show Okay, so as always guys, I love you all. See you guys later. Peace out.